Well, hello. I bet you wonder what I've been doing with my day today. As you can see, I've been taking care of my little seedlings here. Yeah, they're coming along nicely, including the ones that I've changed the plans on. Um, I've got a message here from Quiet. Uh, he says, are you going to show me what's growing in your garden? <laughs> my garden. We know whose garden this is. Yeah. I hope the plants are thriving. He wants to see the new tomatoes at the top level, mustard, sweet potatoes on both levels, the two zucchini plants, the persimmon, and the little midget mango, <laughs> which was fruiting. Yeah. So uh, that's what we're going to do today. And I'm so glad you're here today so you can help me out. Let's remember what's on the list. And um, <laughs> yeah, come on, you guys. Let's go show quiet the garden. <laughs> Come on, let's get to it. Here we go, we're starting with the um, new tomatoes here, quiet. I actually saw a little tomato here. We've got blooms. There's some, some little tomatoes here. Can you see them? There they are. Got a little lower, there you go. Nice shot. While some of them are doing good, I have several that are just really tiny and they're still connected to the ground. A lot of times when I find a plant is struggling, chances are it's not connected to the ground. Something has eaten it. So here's the sweet potatoes that are next to this. Let's come back here so we can get a good look at the whole roll. And then over to the side here. There's a little pumpkin. There are the uh, sweet potatoes that are down on the second level. And look at there, there's potatoes here. Potatoes too. That's your chamolia. So happy. You can see the other sweet potatoes here. Here's the green beans you planted. And I want you to see something very not nice. Something has eaten half the roll. Or they've disappeared. I don't know where they went. I look at this, you guys. Signs that fall is coming. My grape plants are always the first ones to start telling me it's almost time for fall. Here's some more green beans that you planted right before you left. You see that hole? Yep, something is eating here. Right next to the zucchinis, but the zucchinis still look nice and healthy. That beautiful. You can see how nice and full they are. They take up the whole width of the bed. There you go. This is the guava. And here, here it comes. What do you think? Full of persimmons. Let's get back and give you a better view. Uh, those dried leaves up there, those are the grapevines. Here's the little mango that Quiet bought. And this is what he wants to see. It's got a couple of little mangoes on it. 
this is only the second summer it's been in the garden. But I don't know how old this was when he bought it. I don't think it tells anywhere. I'm going to have to check. There's a channel called um, King Show, and he asked if I take care of the whole garden myself. Well, I take care of it alone most of the time, but when my husband's home on the weekends, he helps, and <laughs> he's a lot better at it than me, so it doesn't take him that long to get things done. And on a normal year, we have a friend that would come in and help with the prickly pear, and also with some of the picking of the fruit from some of the bigger trees. So no, I don't do it all myself. I get by with a little help from my friends. And Terry King, he thinks it's a good idea that we just keep on doing the experiment. And that way we'll be able to tell it could be useful for someone else. So yeah, as you can see the cabbage are still looking pretty good. And they're all still here. Well friends, it's that time again. As you can tell, it is getting dark. It's time for me to go in and have myself a nice cup of hot tea. Mm -hmm. My daughter got me some, it's called chocolate. <laughs> chocolate tea. <laughs> yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go in and have some tea. But before I do, I wanna thank you for spending some time with me. Mm -hmm. I really enjoy our time together and I can't wait to catch up with your next videos. So um, until next time, you guys, bye-bye for now. See you soon, bye-bye. Bye.